What happens to our rivers? The little water that has been there is now going to be shared with industrialists. What happens to this vast land that we have been grazing peacefully is now being fenced off. It's tough time for us as Karamojongs. Karamoja is a remote region of Uganda on the Kenyan border. Communities in Karamoja are pastoralists or agro-pastoralists. Many of them rely on cattle keeping and livestock as a form of survival. During the dry season, they have increasingly turned to gold mining or marble and rock crushing to get access to cash to buy food. But in general, food insecurity remains a real problem throughout Karamoja. The government has turned to private investment, particularly mining, as a way to develop the region and potentially be a way to alleviate poverty. <laughs> Companies arrived with documentation from the capital, giving them exploration licenses. In most cases, they hadn't met with local district officials, they hadn't met with local community leaders, they hadn't met with traditional elders of the communities themselves. And in some cases, they began soil sampling, installing excavators on the land, and carrying out exploration work without any of that consultation beginning. Clearly these companies are seeking to make serious money and the government of Uganda also stands to benefit financially should this mining activity really take off. Almost every corner of Karamoja now has an exploration license over it or applications are pending. The government needs to ensure that communities can get access to certificates to prove legal ownership over this land. It'll be on that basis that communities get access to royalty payments. Under international law, these communities have a right to free, prior, and informed consent. The constitution is very clear. The land belongs to the people. We are not refusing you to take the material, but can we know what is our part? These materials, they get depleted. They're not there forever. So the moment they have gone away, yes, you will have not taken away Karamoja, but you will have changed the environment in this place. The risk for the communities in Karamoja is serious. People in Karamoja have faced generations of discrimination, and now that this private investment is coming in, they need to be part of this mining process as it continues, or their rights are going to be violated and their livelihoods will suffer as a result.